Kenny said cheese through the video. Sorry, I haven't uploaded in a minute. Um, but today we're gonna be doing kind of an action figure. I haven't been feeling very well. First of all, I've been feeling really dizzy. But I decided my friend, uh, my friend Morris uploaded a video. You should check it out. Uh, it's already got 17 views in 21 in 21 hours. So it's pretty good. Hot topic at the moment. It's uh, how strong Spider-Man is in Civil War. You should check it out. Uh, yeah. But anyway, uh, today I'm gonna be doing a review on my custom Spider-Man Civil War action figure. Um, now this is one of the longer customs. I normally, like, boost out a custom in a good day, but, uh, this one took me around, grand total, of, like, four days to, uh, complete. He is based on the Marvel Legends, uh, Scarlet Spider figure, uh, the Ben Riley, Peter Parker, Sp well, Ben Riley Spider-Man, but it's not the normal Scarlet Spider, it's the, uh, Spider-Man outfit for him, when, uh, Peter Parker went away for a while. But basically, um... It's a complete and total repaint of that figure. Uh, but yeah, everything you see on him is completely repainted. The paints I used are a gloss black apple barrel, a white apple barrel for the eyes, though gloss black was for the webbing, a flat black apple barrel for the black parts, like the flat black, like the spider emblem on his chest, which took me a while to do. Um, and the rest of it there are a blue testers, uh, car uh, Ford engine blue I believe it's called and a M Mephisto uh red uh what's it called Citadel paints. Uh now I'm not a very big fan of Citadel paints uh but I guess I'm it's kind of growing on me. The paint chip isn't as bad as when it initially dries. You just got to give it time to cure. Now, uh there are some major differences between this costume and the screen accurate version of the Spider-Man Civil War um one you may notice is that on the costume, there are double kind of web lines, and I just kind of did a thicker black because I had a uh, precise paintbrush, but it wasn't... I can't do that. It's, like, not human pos human pos humanly possible for me at the moment. Another big difference are the web shooters on the screen use costume. They're just a black band with a web shooter and the rest. These are the original web shooters. I gave them a... Uh, I took them, and I gave them... First, I dry brushed them. Well, I kind of gave. Well, what I did was I gave it a wash to get in the cracks, and then I dry brushed it a little bit with the black. I like cleaned it so it would be in the cracks, and then I dry brushed it. It's black, and I did that on both of these web shooters, and that's how I got that effect. And then I, the hardest part I'd have to say, is not actually the spider, but the line, the wet lining. Uh, you, you notice it starts to get a little bit sloppy here on the back because I kind of just was like, screw it, this is too getting, this is getting too hard, especially on the legs here, but yeah. Um, the articulation is completely perfect. There's no real paint rub. I did the lines going up as far as I could. Uh, in the back, it's like there's no real paint rub. Uh, there's a little bit on the elbows, but that's to be expected. Um, yeah, here he is in comparison to my Ant-Man figure, but, which I didn't do. It will to Giant Man. Oh, God, I feel terrible. Like, like when I sit, but, uh, yeah, the body for this Spider-Man is way too big. I don't like it, but... Here it is compared to my Civil War Ant-Man. I'll have to do a review on him soon. Uh, he's using the uh, Demolition Man body, but I, well, the original Electro, Amazing Spider-Man 2 Electro body, but the Demolition Man re-release, I guess you could say. Same head. Uh, heads made out of foam. Complete repaint. Really good looking figure in my opinion. But let's put him to his, let's put his side. Uh, here he is compared to the Marvel Legends Absorbing Man, Build a Figure Wave, uh, Venom. He, I can't really get him standing up right now. I'm in my bed because I don't want to get up and go to my desk. My review desk, quick flash. Ooh, my room started. I shouldn't have done that. I need to clean my room up. But yeah, here's him compared to that. And then also, lastly, if I can find him, I'm working on a shield for him. I'll probably have it on within the next two days. I haven't been feeling very well, like I said. If I can find this stupid thing, I can show you. Um... I'm gonna keep it like this so I don't get a terrible thumbnail. Like I normally do. Uh, can't find it. But he uses the same body base as the Marvel Legends. Well, he's the Marvel Legends Pizza Spidey figure with the elongated torso and the Superior Spider Man's legs. But yeah. So he uses the same as my uh, Superior Venom action figure, which is one of my favorite in the collection. Despite what people say, I do like the elongated torso. I feel like it really worked for that character because in the artwork, in the artwork for the Superior uh, Venom issues when this is Pierce Spider-Man he really in every dip in, di in every panel his body's in a different shape but his legs are always really lanky and long and he's walking like Doc Ock would because he is Doc Ock with his uh tendrils moving before like when he really should be 
But that's why I like that figure. I don't like this figure particularly because the elongated torso makes them look like uh, baby legs. Detective baby legs from Rick and Morty. But, um, yeah. This back spider's not very good. Uh, but yeah. And then what I did was I took some, uh, I can't remember the name of the paint. But I took it and it was a metallic-ish. And I used it. And it's a little bit gray, a little bit metallic, but I uh, shortened the eyes. If you look on there really close, you can see the original. Put my hand behind it. Sorry, I'm using my phone. It's not a very good camera. You see where the eyes should be? I made them a little bit smaller. I got to do a repaint on this eye. You can see the black coming through. But yeah, basically what I did was I took the figure and I painted this part black. I mean red. And all the rest red. First I washed it. Like, actually washed it. And then I did the head that's the first thing i did and i started doing lines on the chest well before i did lines on the chest i did this part but yeah uh hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to rate comment subscribe um use your force powers on that like button and uh drop a big old steven bomb on that subscribe button this is kenny said she's signing out peace guys hope you enjoyed the video